Alright, hey guys. Um, I'm gonna show you how to survive your first night in Minecraft. If you just got it, you probably won't know how to play that well. So, let's, um, let's get started. I'm just gonna wait for it to build the terrain during the level. Alright, I spawned in a pretty bad spot, but for some reason, um, you always spawn in sand, so, oh, I accidentally have my fly model. I'm not using any mods, because it'll show up in this corner, if I have a mod, like, it'll say something like, that's my fly mod, that's my builder's mod, that's my cheater's mod, but I'm just gonna get rid of all those right now. Oh, I'm so free, oh, pumpkin, okay, so, anyway, first, all you would do is, since I'm in the middle of nowhere and there's like no wood by me, I'm just gonna go out and explore and try to get some wood. And I am just gonna stack up some sand to let me know where my spawn is exactly. And then you just head out and look for stuff and I found a pumpkin right in the beginning. So, pumpkins are pretty cool. You can wear a pumpkin on your head. And then you get the mask. But I'm not gonna do that. Right okay, so we have a tree right here. I'm just gonna... There's a couple trees, actually. And you're gonna just hold down left click. I know so I know like this is stupid. All of you probably know this, but for some reason people like if you just got Minecraft, you would think you just keep on left clicking like this. But you, in reality you just hold it down. Hold your left left click down. Oh uh, yeah, spawn still over there. Gonna get some more wood. It's a good idea to get the saplings from the tree, like when the leaves break. It's a good idea to get the saplings so you can replant a tree, but I'm not gonna do that right now. Because we got to go until nightfall. My bad, sorry, I had it on peaceful. We gotta wait, we gotta go till we gotta keep on moving. Till nightfall. Now, you can get a lot of wood if there's a lot of wood by you. You can um, get a lot of wood to make a wooden house. So I have another mod on. Um, yeah, you could build a wooden house, but um, I'm not going to because I don't have that many trees next to me. And, um, due to Notch's update, you can only get wool from shears, but you can kill them and they only drop one, though. So, um, I mean, it's better than just, um, waiting till you get shears to get a bed. And now I have three wool, so I should be fine. And my spawn's just right there. Now, I'm going to find a good little spot to build a house, or a home, or a cave underground, I don't know. Um, right here's a good spot, so I'm just going to start digging down. Uh, dirt is pretty useful when you're first starting out. So, just try to get all of it. And I am just going to use the excess dirt I have. To 
make it like a little cave opening. So if I leave it open, then monsters can get in. So I'm just not going to do that. So I'll just close this up. And there is a reason why I do not have coal. And I will show you why. But I should have kept something else. Alright, I'm just gonna go get some more wood. I have a wooden axe. Alright, so, yeah. So, you're just gonna have to get, um, as much of the wood as you can. Alright, so, I got my wood, I got my spawn right there, got my little cave right here, happy little cave that I haven't finished, and I'm gonna craft a pickaxe, that's another axe, pickaxe, and I am going to go down one more step. And I am going to make a shovel. <coughs> and, um, yeah. So we're just going to clear out some of this dirt. It doesn't have to be the best living space as long as it's shelter. Because shelter is shelter. And I am just going to make it this big. And now I'm just going to fill up this step. Because I don't really need to go down no more. And I now have three stones, so I am just gonna make a stone pickaxe. I'm just gonna head up here and finish my cave overhead thing. I don't know what I'm gonna call it. And it is pretty dark down here. And I do need more cobblestone. Because I am going to make a furnace, and furnaces will smelt um, your ore into ingots, and it will um, do other magical things. And one of the magical things it can do, I will show you in a second. Oh, it's turning nighttime. I better hurry up with this. Um, it will take planks, and if you convert, you can convert wood into something special called charcoal. Which is why I did not go out and get coal. I can just get charcoal instead. So, it's pretty cool. And it also provides a light source when it's heating up. And one plank um, will heat up one and a half things, like one and a half logs or whatever. In this case, logs, yes. And works the same way as coal. It does not stack with coal because they're two different things. And I'm just gonna light it up. I'm gonna cover this up because, yeah. And 
have a door. Too much charcoal. Make another door. And we have a we have a little cave right here. Close up the doors and good. I have enough for a bed which you can sleep in when it's nighttime and um once it's nighttime and you sleep in there then it will turn to daytime magically and yeah so um, that's basically it it's now turning nighttime So, um, yeah. It's a cool little thing. So, um, yeah. Oh, sweet. There's reeds over there. Um, with reeds, you can make a reed farm, which is pretty cool. And you can make bookcases and cake. So, that's pretty cool. Alright, um, since it's turning nighttime right now, as you all can see, I, c I actually do not have a mod for making it daytime. That's a command, single player commands, I don't have that. So if I just sleep on my handy dandy little bed, we will turn it to morning. Oh, it's very special. Alright, thanks for watching guys, rate, comment, subscribe, or no, not rate, like, yeah, you gotta like this now, okay, so like, comment, and subscribe.